Hello guys, welcome to Chemical Hub and so today we are going to start a new topic called Cumin. The chemical formula is C6H5CH CH3 twice. The chemical reaction involving this process are benzene plus propylene gets converted to cumin that is isopropyl benzene. The side reaction is benzene plus n moles of propylene gets converted to polyisopropyl benzene. The raw materials for this reaction are benzene and propylene. Also, H3PO4 is used as a catalyst. The operating conditions for this reaction are pressure of 25 atm and temperature of 250 degrees Celsius. The reaction here is exothermic and acetone is produced as a co-product. Now, let us discuss the flow sheet for this reaction. First of all, propylene and propane that are obtained from refinery process of naphtha steam cracking plant, they are both mixed with benzene and both of them are sent to a compressor and compressed to 25 atm. Next, the mixture enters the heat exchanger where this feed is preheated and then it is sent to the packed bed reactor from the top. This packed bed reactor has H3PO4 impregnated catalyst. Now the steam distribution of the packed bed reactor has a cold shot arrangement which means that the cold propane from distillation column is added in every reactor with the product stream so that the temperature of the stream is controlled. Next, the propylene here is acting as a limiting reagent. Therefore, it undergoes conversion. Now the propane controls the reaction temperature around 250 degrees centigrade and then the vapors are again cooled using the heat exchanger. Here heat integration concept is used. And now these vapors are now passed through a depropanizer unit. In this depropanizer unit, the propane is separated from the top and is recycled for the quenching operation and the from the bottom part, we get benzene, cumin and poly, polyalkyl benzene and it is again sent to next distillation column that is the benzene column. From the benzene column, the benzene is separated and sent for the recycling process and again it is fed from this at the start point with the feed. From the bottom we obtain cumin and also polyalkyl benzenes are formed here which is next sent to the cumin column. In the cumin column cumin is obtained as a top product while the polyalkyl benzene are obtained as a bottom product. The major engineering problems for this process are the first is the reactor design which should be taken care of as we use the stage wise packed tower with propane quenching. The second is for the removal of additional heat and water injector should be used as an alternative method. The third is polyalkyl benzene formation is to be minimized by using high feed ratios of benzene to propylene and propane the dilution method should be used. I hope you understood this flow sheet. Do like, share and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.